Mount Everest, the roof of the world. Mount Everest, towering at 8,848.86 meters, is the highest mountain on Earth and a symbol of human ambition and endurance. Situated in the Himalayas, on the border between Nepal and Tibet, Everest has captivated adventurers, climbers, and explorers for centuries. Its majestic peaks, harsh conditions, and profound cultural significance make it a fascinating subject of study. Mount Everest is part of the Mahalangar Himal sub-range of the Himalayas. It was formed about 60 million years ago as the Indian tectonic plate collided with the Eurasian plate, pushing the land upwards. This geological activity continues today, making Everest a dynamic and evolving mountain. The mountain is characterized by a variety of terrains, including steep rock faces, glaciers, and snowfields. The most notable features include the South Col, the Hillary Step, and the summit itself, which is often covered in snow and ice. The Kumbu Icefall, situated on the approach to the summit from the south, is particularly treacherous, with shifting ice and deep crevices posing significant risks to climbers. The history of climbing Mount Everest is rich and varied, beginning with early expeditions in the 19th century. The first recorded attempt to reach the summit was made by British explorer George Mallory in 1921. However, he and his climbing partner disappeared during their 1924 attempt, leaving their fate a mystery for decades. The first successful ascent was achieved on May 29, 1953, by Sir Edmund Hillary from New Zealand in Tenzing Norge, a Sherpa of Nepal. Their achievement was celebrated worldwide and marked a significant milestone in mountaineering history. Since then, numerous climbers have reached the summit, and each season witnesses a new wave of adventurers attempting the climb. There are two primary routes to the summit. Southeast Ridge Route This route begins at the Everest Base Camp in Nepal. Located at an altitude of about 5,364 meters, climbers typically acclimatize by ascending to higher camps before making their final push to the summit. The journey involves navigating the treacherous Kumbu Icefall, traversing the western Quim, and ascending the Lot's face before reaching the summit. North Ridge Route This route, starting from the Tibetan side, is less frequented and requires a different set of permits. Climbers face challenges such as the lack of established support and harsher weather conditions. However, it offers a unique perspective on the mountain and its surrounding landscape. The weather on Mount Everest is notoriously unpredictable and extreme. Climbers face severe cold, high winds, and rapidly changing conditions. The best climbing season is typically from late April to early June when the weather is relatively stable. However, conditions can still be harsh, with temperatures at the summit dropping below minus 60 degrees Celsius during winter months. Altitude sickness is a significant risk for climbers, as the thin air at high elevations contains less oxygen. Symptoms can range from mild headaches to severe altitude sickness, which can be life-threatening. Acclimatization is crucial for climbers to adapt to these conditions, and many spend weeks at various camps to prepare for the final ascent. The increasing popularity of Mount Everest has raised considerable environmental and ethical concerns. The influx of climbers has led to issues such as waste management, overcrowding, and the degradation of the surrounding environment. Base camps and climbing routes often become littered with trash, including abandoned gear and human waste. In recent years, there have been efforts to address these problems, including initiatives to clean up the mountain and promote responsible climbing practices. 
organizations and governments are working to implement stricter regulations regarding permits and environmental protection to preserve the integrity of Everest. Mount Everest holds deep cultural significance for the local Sherpa people who view the mountain as sacred. The Sherpa's expertise is invaluable as they navigate the challenging terrains and help ensure climbers' safety. Their resilience and connection to the land highlight the profound relationship between the local population and Mount Everest. As climbing technology and techniques advance, the allure of Mount Everest continues to attract climbers from all walks of life. However, the increasing commercialization of the mountain raises questions about sustainability and the ethical implications of such activities. Balancing adventure with environmental stewardship is crucial to preserving Everest for future generations. Climbers must also consider the risks associated with the ascent. Each season, the mountain claims lives due to accidents, exposure, and altitude sickness. The realities of high-altitude climbing serve as a reminder of nature's power and the need for respect and preparation. In conclusion, Mount Everest stands not only as the highest peak on Earth, but also as a testament to human determination in the spirit of exploration. It embodies the challenges and triumphs of climbers while highlighting the importance of environmental conservation and cultural respect. As we look to the future, it is essential to approach Mount Everest with a sense of responsibility, ensuring that its majesty can be appreciated by generations to come. Whether as a climber, a researcher, or a nature enthusiast, the allure of Everest remains a powerful draw, reminding us of the extraordinary beauty and challenges that our planet holds.